President Bongbong Marcos brings home some 700 billion pesos worth of investment pledges and contributions from his recently concluded working visit in Japan. The President says this could generate up to 24,000 jobs for Filipinos. Ian Suyu with the details. Arriving from his five-day visit to Japan, President Marcos said the Philippines is successful in convincing Japanese leaders and business executives to consider Philippines as a potential investment site for their companies. The Philippines is looking at 700 billion pesos worth of investment pledges following Marcos's Japan trip. Marcos said the amount of pledges they garnered could create 24,000 jobs and help provide economic stability in the country. He also announced that the Japanese government has committed around 3 billion US dollars to aid Philippines major projects such as the North-South Commuter Railway that will pass through Malolos, Bulacan to Tutuban, Manila as well as the North-South Commuter Railway project extension. Coming back, we carry with us over 13 billion US dollars in contributions and pledges to benefit our people, create approximately 24,000 jobs, and further solidify the foundations of our economic environment. As uh, ever, our partner Japan committed to provide in infrastructure development loans for two major projects, the North-South Commuter Railway for Malolos to Tuban and the North-South Commuter Railway project extension. Aside from this, the government floated the possibility of entering a visiting forces agreement with Japan and a possible tripartite agreement with the United States. We have cemented our defense and security relations. We have also uh, covered a great deal of ground in the areas of agriculture, ICT, cooperation, and with the signing of bilateral agreements that provide the framework for enhanced mutually beneficial collaboration in many areas. As part of the final stretch of his visit, Marcos met with the Filipino community in Japan and assured them that the Philippines will be able to open more jobs for its citizens. According to the Immigration Services of Japan, there are around 267,000 Filipinos residing there since 2021. And while I know that they are doing well there and are very well respected in their profession, I assure them that this administration is committed to creating more job opportunities in the Philippines so that working abroad will become a career choice and not, uh, not the only option available to them. For News 5, Ian Suyu. We are One News.